that way for long. No, Mark, you know, um, the field when we first went out was in fine shape, but after the first floor, they saw it raining so hard that the coach began to sell it. And you see we don't get a good snap here, uh, mishandling the ball. Uh, that's a good play coming up inside off our, off our uh, left guard. There. And we come out here, uh, we're trying to get something going with the option and couldn't. We had to punt the football away. I thought Earl Bryant did a good job of punting the football last night under the conditions. He still is above 40 yards from punting. There's pretty good coverage. He, he was able to turn it up, but still not there. Um, they come here on offense, uh, quarterback. Really didn't complete a pass at all last night. This first, you know, the first time they ever seen a game where not even one pass is completed. Mm -hmm. uh, this is a good play here by Damon Johnson out of Atlanta. Uh, I think our defense is getting off the football. We're not... Right here, we don't get off our blocks. We kind of stay on our blocks a little longer. Uh, we're going to have to really look at that today uh, in our game, Tim, and see just what the reason why we were hanging on our blocks. Uh, they punt the ball here. Ball goes into the end zone, and their punter did a good job because it was a defensive struggle at times last night because of the weather. We didn't get a good block here by a center. It's a good pass from Basil Sharp. And I thought a flag should have been thrawn here, but uh, the guy over there in the striped shirt saw it differently. Extra rough. Uh, Richard man. rolls out, and we can't hang on to the football. That was intended for Ken Brown. We come back again on a toss here to Corey Latson, and I tell you, he, he makes a good run out of this. And to have been off a year, I thought Corey had a, a good football game. He's an impact football player. You can see here, he comes up on the sprint and runs into a couple of our guys that should be blocking, but uh, Corey's going to be a, a great college athlete. Uh, he's a good individual. He's going to be a great uh, uh, college athlete because uh, he's an impact football player. He brings something to our football team that's very much needed, and that's speed. And he runs well up on the inside, and that's a good run by Latson again. And we saw Edwin Ford in the You're right. We run the, option, run the option here, and Basil decided to keep the football because he didn't have a good mesh point. Uh, Edwin Ford carries it up inside for a little game. The team's really moving right now. Moving pretty good, you know. Field condition, this is a good catch here by Ken Brown and a good throw by Richard Basil. Brown is having a good year as tight end, and uh, you can see here we go back. Uh, this was a pill, well, the penalty flag was strong, but it was a good call by the official because the ball was uncatchable. It was interference, but the ball was uncatchable. There you come back again on it. Uh, we had to check on that second receiver in that area today. Uh, this is Edward Ford, makes a tough run. Ford is, is, is getting better uh, game by game, and we uh, go here on the pitch out to the last, and you see him getting some yardage. Breaking some yardage. tackles. Breaking yeah. some tackles. He's big and strong, and there you go with the field goal. And then the pitch up. comes on and kicks, kicks a good field goal that we go up 3-0. Now here you are uh, in further action, and the team's moving once again toward another touchdown. Well, you can see last and last had 87 yards last night rushing for his first week of game, and after being out of here, uh, he does a good job. You can see him kicking his way here. And, uh, dodging tackles and he's a shifty runner. It's hard to get a bead on him because he's constantly on the move. Basil goes back to pass here and he's being chased. And this could have been disastrous, but uh, they weren't able to come up with the interception. He comes right back the other side and looks. Well, I think our offensive line did real well. And this is a great pass here to last. And this is what we were planning to do last night uh, is to get him out on the corner and get him one on one with the linebacker. And we did early in the ball game, but. Uh, as the weather, you know, became un unbearable, we couldn't get the ball to him. And you can see the excitement and the jubilation. We run him out here. Our offensive line did a good job of blocking on that. There's the pass. Uh, one of the things about him and the fact that he uh, has good hands, he's able to catch the football, and Pitts come on here. We don't do a good job of blocking on that corner, but he makes the extra point, and we go up 10-0 at that point. And then here's Alabama and m on the drive. They come back, and they're doing something. They're lining up on double tights with two tight ends and a wingman sometimes. Then they go to the wishbone. Uh, you can see our defensive people there, Hurd and Good Johnson, point. and uh, tied all of them around the football. And they pick up the first down. Now here where it is, where the, the clouds just open up. and The rain came down. Look at that rain. Rainy night in Georgia. I tell you. We don't do a good job of taking quarterback here on this option. Uh, and you can see the rain is coming down this sheet. It come back again. I, I don't know who that is over there, but we'll find out on the film today. They got a good run off the option. You mentioned that the uh, right. our taking the quarterback wasn't as good sometimes as it should have been. Right. Our defense is really buckling down here. They, they find a gap. We're not getting off those blocks like we should. And they call us offside. And I can't understand this for the, oh, man, the ball didn't go our way. 
They call us offside on this, and I couldn't understand that. Mm -hmm. But you know, you can't question the official because they, they say you can't question, but some things I, I had some disagreements from some time with them. And here you go, up top. But up this top. Is a great, great play there by, by Eric Brown. Eric Brown. We're going to see this one again because he was right one on one and the coverage was excellent. Eric is a good uh, defensive back because he has the ability to play man to man and he plays it well because he breaks on the ball and covers well. Now this he comes is a here third down or fourth down here. I think this is a third off third down play and they pick up a first down and after a while they're going to get a we're going to get a penalty uh, and they're going to move the ball down and they're going to score. And they run off. They run off tackle. Right tackle. There's a penalty there. The flag goes down. You know what he called? He said the linebacker was holding. And the linebacker was the one made the tackle. So I asked him, how is he going to make the tackle if he can't hold it? You know, <laughs> that was a weird call there. Yes, and here they come back. They come the back. And, you know, our defense is worn down now because of the penalties and the extra downs that they were given. But, you know, they're trying to hang in there. That's Mike Wallace over there. And, you can see Eugene Johnson, all I'm trying to get around the football, but Alabama a and scored. And they had the extra point. They had the extra point. And we're still leading at this point, 10-7. to 7 and That's the way we go out in the first half. Here's just one little last play, but this is going to end the first half. See Richard running for his life there. Second half highlights after this. We get off.